Hello, my name is Juniper Meadows and I am a transgender woman. Just saying those words can be the hardest experience of an LGBTQ person's life and coming out can be especially hard here. The Human Rights Campaign ranks Tennessee among the least gay-friendly states in the country. But regardless of where you live, coming out is deeply personal. Here are three people's experiences in their own words. To understand my coming out story, you first have to understand why I was so hesitant to do so in the first place. I actually came out two summers ago and it was completely spontaneous. So I came out in around 2012, really started pursuing transition then. You know, once you're out in the open, there's, there's no going back. So everyone's gonna hold a different opinion of you. And it wasn't easy in East Tennessee, certainly. Um, there were struggles with family. There continue to be struggles with family. It's completely understandable if you're not ready. At some point I had to ask myself, do I want to keep making everyone else happy or do I finally want to be happy? Who wouldn't want that? To embrace oneself fully. I just want you to know that you are not alone. I'm here for you and there are so many other people out there that are cheering you on. I've gotten to the point where I know I'm not going to get a positive reaction from everybody, but it doesn't bother me. These past 10 years have taught me that there is enough love. And that would be my advice to people struggling with coming out today, that to remember that there is enough love. It felt really, really good to do it at that point, just because, you know, all my friends and everybody that I wanted to know knew, but it was my way of telling the world officially who I am and who I've always been. And that's my story. Of course, those are just snippets of their stories. They also talk about resources and where they found support in our community.